The truth is something I've wrestled with, and now it feels like it's eating away at me. I don't even know how to begin, but here I am, attempting to tear down the mask I've worn with you. This confession has haunted me for a long time, but now I don't think I can keep it hidden anymore. From the very beginning, there was a part of me I kept in the shadows. A part of me that, perhaps, you sensed but chose not to question. I wish I could say it was something I planned to reveal, something I intended to bring into the open once I felt ready. But as days turned to weeks and weeks to months, I buried it deeper, allowing it to believe in a version of me that wasn't entirely true. I know how much you've trusted me, how much you've seen the good in me. In moments when I felt concerned by my own lies, I'd find myself hoping you'd never see through them. I told myself that I'd change, that I'd somehow become the person you believed me to be. But the truth is, I can't love you. I never could, not fully. And the reason for that is something I'm ashamed to admit. I'm terrified of love, terrified of what it demands. Love, at its core, requires a vulnerability I've never been able to give. The idea of truly opening up, of exposing my deepest fears, my darkest secrets, that has always felt an impossible task for me. So instead, I hid, I let you believe in a version of me that was safe, kind and unbroken. But that version doesn't exist, not in the way you imagined. I realize now that this fear has controlled me for far too long. It has wrapped my intentions, leading me to act in ways that were selfish and in some cases, cruel. I wanted the comfort of your love without the cost of truly opening my heart. I held on to you, not out of pure love, but out of my own need to feel less alone, to have someone by my side who saw me as better than I really am. You didn't deserve this. You didn't deserve to be brought into a story that was never fully honest. I'm not the person you thought I was. I'm someone who ran from love at every turn, who sailed away from the vulnerability you offered so freely. Instead of admitting my fears, I allowed it you to pour your heart out to a person who was, in many ways, emotionally absent. I look back at the moments we shared and I can see so clearly now how unfair I was. You showed up for me time and time again, bringing light into places at long left dark. And I, I only allowed myself to bask in that light without offering any of my own. I kept my heart hidden, guarded, unwilling to let you see the real me, because I was afraid that, if you knew the truth, you'd walk away. And here's where the worst of it lies. Somewhere along the way, I realized that what I was doing wasn't right. But instead of coming clean, I let things go on. 
I tried to convince myself that maybe somehow I could change that I could become the person you believed me to be. Yet deep down, I knew that my intentions were never as pure as you deserved. I knew that I was clinging to you out of fear and selfishness, not out of the selfless love you deserved. You deserve to be loved by someone who isn't afraid of what love requires. Someone who will stand beside you with an open heart, willing to face their fears for the chance to build something real and true. I wish I could be that person for you, but I'm not. I am someone who, when faced with the choice between being vulnerable and staying hidden, chose the latter time and time again. I know that what I'm saying may feel like a betrayal and in many ways it is. I betrayed the trust you placed in me by pretending to be someone I wasn't. I held on to you for reasons that were rooted in my own insecurities rather than genuine affection. And though I wish I could undo the hurt I've caused, I know that my words can only go so far. In confessing this, I'm not looking for forgiveness. I understand that this may be unforgivable. I simply needed to be honest to let you see the reality of who I am and what I've done. You gave me a love that was pure and open and I took it for granted. I took it as something that could fill the emptiness inside me without ever giving you the fullness of my own heart in return. I hope someday you can find it in your heart to look back on this and see that the issue was never with you. It was my own weakness, my own inability to face the vulnerability love requires that led us here. You were never the one at fault. You were nothing but kind, nothing but giving. And I wish I'd had the courage to be the same for you. All I can say now is that I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the pain I've caused. For the lies I allowed it to pile up between us. I'm sorry for letting my fears rule me and for holding you in a relationship that was never fully honest. I wish you a love that's free from fear, a love that's as open and genuine as you deserve. In the end, I am left with only my regret and the hope that you will find a strength to heal, to move forward and to find someone who will give you everything I couldn't. Prayer for wisdom and financial strength, repeat after me. O oh Lord, today I seek your wise guiding light. Help me to walk with patience and insight. Let no task be delayed, no duty ignored. May my prudence increase as I move forward. Help me avoid pitfalls, both great and small. With your wisdom, Lord, I can conquer it all. Bless my efforts, my reputation uphold, as I gain the trust of loved ones, that respect unfold. Control my expenses, keep them in line, that I may prosper with blessings divine. Help my children find their calling and way, and let new dreams of property not delay. If challenges arise or opponents oppose, stand by me, Lord, 
as strength overflows. Grant resolution in matters of love and kin. Bring peace to conflicts and clarity within. With elder guidance, may decisions unfold in wisdom and peace that our future be told. Bless students, artists, athletes with strength and you that they give their best, remain loyal and true. In risk or reward, let your guidance be near. Guard them from loss, wipe away every tear. Let our day be filled with love, joy and might. In your blessings and wisdom, make everything right. Like this video and type Amen to claim this prayer.